So for today, we're going to be looking at Warlocks. Specifically, we're going to be looking at your Witcher sets that I made. If you guys don't know, we already reviewed the armor. It's right here. And we went through the shader video as well, which is right here as well. Uh, essentially, we go over how it looks, how it shaders, my personal thoughts, and overall, a pretty good video in my opinion. The shader video, we go through all of the shaders that I currently own. And then for the Hunter and Titan videos... We essentially do what we're going to do in this video where we get individual pieces from this set, which is the Witcher set, and then make individual sets with that. So if you guys, if this is your first, that's what we usually do. We review the armor, then shaders, and then we go for the individual sets for the classes. So Warlocks, you guys are up next. Let's start with the helmet. So for the helmet, Hexer Hood is what we're using. I definitely think this is the dopest set so far. I know we just looked at this one, but dude, honestly, this one is amazing. Don't get me wrong. We do have ones that are like kind of okay. This one, however, I think is super cool. This is a variant of my Warlock Battle Mage look that I made. The only difference is we're using, we're using the Boot of the Assembler exotic with the Homespun Boots ornament on it instead of Nezarek Sin. So for the arms, Deep Explorer gloves is what we're using because I want to have a bulky look on my Warlock. And Gunsmith Devotion robes also gives me that look. Then for the bond, Hexer bond because it's a shield, makes sense to me. For the shader, we're using, we're using Scarlet Semblance because I want that like, you've been in the muck, you've been killing shit. And honestly, Scarlet Semblance just gives me that look, which is why I really, really like it. As for the next set, we're going to be utilizing the Hexer Gloves for this one. And I actually like this one a lot just because the Hexer Gloves goes really well with anything fur related. And obviously, we're using a lot of pieces that have fur. We're using the Lycan Robes, a lot of fur on there. We're using the Dark Age Leg Braces, which again, a lot of fur in there. And then we're using the Phoenix Ren Renaissance Ornament for the Dawn Chorus. I definitely think this looks amazing. I really, really like this one a lot too, just because... Don Cur Chorus, more specifically the Phoenix uh, Renaissance ornament looks amazing with it. And overall, I do think this set just looks amazing. Let me know what you guys think. As for the next set, again, another banger. This one we're going to be using Iron to Steel, which is kind of funny. I didn't notice that all the classes had Iron to Steel as a shader. But for the helmet, we're going to be using Felwinter's Helm because I'm going for a Felwinter look. For the arms, Iron Pledge ornament is what we're using. Don't worry, I will have the Iron Pledge armor review hopefully by the next iron banner or pretty close to that because i still have to do the shader review as well for that for the chest piece hex of robes is what we're using boots iron companion legs and then for the bond we're using the ossuary bond ossuary ossuary Osu either way we're using that bond so i really like this one a lot because it gives the sense of like you could definitely see Felwinter using this look because there's a lot of Iron Banner stuff in this, but we're using the Ossuary Bond because I like that one a lot. But I mean, you could use an Iron Banner one as well. Overall, I really like this one. Probably my favorite, favorite if I'm being honest. I just find it funny considering that Felwinter is not my favorite exotic for Warlocks. And then last but not least, I do think this one is kind of not the, like, it's the L of the group because it's not as good as the other ones personally, but I still think it looks pretty cool. For the Helmet, Hood of the Great Hunt is what we're using. For the Exotic, we're actually going to be using the Chimera Sting Ornament for the Necrotic Grip. Just because it goes really well with the Nemean Robes. For the Boots, Hexer Boots is what we're using. And then for the Bonds, Fetish Bond. For the Shader, we're using Metro Shift. Um, yeah, honestly, my biggest gripe with the Hexer Boots is just that I think the Titan should have gotten that. Just because it, it would have looked a lot better on a Titan. That being said, I think the biggest issues we don't have any good i shouldn't say that we do have a lot of good ones it's just i didn't find one that i was like oh i like that um more specifically like we don't have a lot of good chest pieces that would go well with this one because you need it to be long enough to cover the thigh but not long enough that it covers the shin and calves because that's literally like the best looking part so that's why i'm like i that's why i'm using the Nemean robes because it just shows one side which is fine but I do want to tweak the Hexer stuff a little bit more just to see if I can find better boot or a better chest piece for it. But overall, this is where my head was going when I first started doing it. Let me know what you guys think. Overall, I definitely think the first one's a banger. Second one's an absolute banger. Third one is probably the best one, if I'm being quite honest, just because it gives off such Fell Winters vibes. And then the last one's like, again, not all of them are going to be great. Uh, some of them are going to be like, okay, I can see where you're going for this, but... Yeah, let me know what you guys think. I appreciate you guys coming up to this point. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell notification if you want to keep up to my content because I do push out a lot of content for this channel. And 
I say that not braggingly, but it's just a matter of fact. Like I push a lot of content out because if you guys really think about it, eat, when we get a new armor set, that's immediately five videos for me. We review the armor, we do the shader video, and then we do the Hunter Titan and Warlock video. So each armor set is five videos and we got like six video or six armor sets this season. And I still haven't gotten the Crota set yet because the chest piece still hasn't dropped for my Warlock. But once I get that, that's another five videos. So that's just on, that's just on armor alone. I also do exotic videos. I also do like sometimes thematic videos, which I want to start doing again. And then that's not even including the week, weekly videos that I do on Tuesdays and Sundays, which we already had one out posted today. So yeah, when I say like I push a lot of content, I really mean it. Uh, so I would really appreciate you guys like liking, commenting. I, I, I It kills me because I am working on my Discord and I keep saying that, but I really do want to open my Discord soon. Just I want it to be really good when, I, when it comes out. I don't want to like have to think about it because I barely have time to do other stuff. So let me know what you guys think. I appreciate you guys. Be safe. I will see you guys later.